I'd like to stay away from you, Cora. That'll be easy. But you just won't let me, will you? Bobby, I spent every nickel I had to come here. Every nickel I made for you, you mean? That puts you right back where I found you. A hungry little nut to name Cora Eubers that nobody ever heard of. Where do you think you're going? Let me go. I swear to you, Monty, if you lay another hand on me again, I'm going to tell the cops. You didn't go to the cops in New York, and you won't go to them here. I will, I tell you. Because while they're asking me questions, you might get a visit from a friend of mine. The last visit you'll ever get. I'd almost settle for that just to see that you get what you have coming to you. I take what's coming to me. Jill Rainey is mine. I made her up. Her name, her background, her success. Sure, I know, it's all a big fat lie. But it's a lie I paid for. So she's mine, not yours. You paid for what you wanted. A fling in show business, and I got a chance to think. It goes both ways. I figure we quit even. Nobody quits until I say so. And I told you a year and a half ago in New York that Jill Rainey sang her last song. Oh, Marty. I have to sing. That's the only thing I know. Oh, it is, huh? Well, you know, you know how to shuck corn, don't you? You know how to milk cows. What did you know when I picked you up in that county fair? <laughs> You know, I don't think you got the point in New York. Jill Rainey doesn't sing anymore. Not in the States, not anywhere in the world. Because any time she does, you owe me a royalty, Cora, which I take out of your hide. All right, Marty. I won't go out there again, I promise. Yeah. You're good at promising, aren't you? No, I mean it, Marty. Please, I'll, I'll go away. I won't sing anymore. Oh, please, what more do you want from me? I just want to be rid of you, you understand? Once and for all, rid of you. But every time you use what I taught you, you use me. And that keeps it alive. Oh, but I'm going to kill it, baby. If there's a next time between us, I'll kill it. I have to kill you to do it. Now take your bag and get out of here. And keep going. Remember what I told you. You let him walk away? Why would we come all the way here from Chicago? anything about it until yesterday. He was afraid you were going to testify against him in front of the federal grand jury. Monty, they're going to kill you. Yeah. I needed some bait for a trap, and you took the job. Yes, but I couldn't go through with it. I tried to call you at the airport to warn you. Now you're double-crossing him. <gasps> you're really a prize package, aren't you? All right, stay here and get shot. Now, that's more like it, baby. You know, when you start warning me, that's when I feel a knife in my back. Well, looks like we're a little early. She's not nearly messed up enough. Work her over so the cops know we saved her. Wait a minute. I didn't turn you in, Rudy. Not that you don't deserve it, but I just don't happen to live that way. You think I'm going to believe that? No, I guess not. If the things were turned around, you'd let them bury me to save your skin. 
I guess it's not much to be proud of, but that's the difference between us. The word's out from the top. Monty Donovan made a deal. Sorry, Monty. Well, Monty! Just get great something and then stop there. 